All right, so I'm gonna give you three tips really quickly if you're feeling depressed, having anxiety, feeling lost in life, and you're just kind of bugging out. Number one is to watch your thoughts. What kind of thoughts you have entering your mind or what even what are you speaking into existence? Like, literally, what do you talk about on a day-to-day -day basis? What are the things you think about? Are you thinking about... Um, how scarce your life is or are you thinking about the potential that you can possibly produce in life or are you just gonna let everything fall by the wayside and throw your hands up like damn I don't know what to do and just stay worried because you really have to take control and be empowered so that's number one is listen to the thoughts that you allow into your head from other people or things that you watch through entertainment or what have you. And the things that you actually speak amongst the people that are around you and your friends and your family. Number two, what are you putting into your body as far as food? Like, I read all labels and I don't compromise on this one bit. So I constantly check labels for things like artificial sweeteners um anything that sounds crazy on a label looks ridiculous shouldn't be in my body it should be actual real food that i'm eating so i try to eat as much fruits and vegetables as possible this is going to elevate your mood if you do the same thing so watch the kind of foods that you're eating one thing that you want to remember is you want to limit sugar Sugar causes a fight or flight response. It's, it, it's, it uh, antagonizes the sympathetic nervous system. So essentially, it gives you the same feeling as a fight or flight response would give you. Another thing, stay away from all hydrogenated oils. These oils will slow you down and kill you. They'll cause inflammation in your body, which produces arthritic pains pain increases your sensitivity to depression and all that shit so stay away from that it's garbage number three self-discipline now self-discipline is what's gonna bring those first two together okay so it's like the trinity now you have to really really want to be better to, in order to really get better. You know what I'm saying? Does that make sense? Because if you don't and you like to complain, then this video is not for you. You can just keep doing what you're doing and keep feeling the way you feel. But if you don't want to accept that anymore and you want to go above and beyond, take responsibility, take control, and get your life back. Get excited. You know, it's really good to be meticulous and to live your life to the fullest because nobody else is going to give you a fulfilled life. You have to take that. That's something you have to take control of. So don't compromise. You know, ask yourself, you know, discipline starts with a lot of things. What are you eating? Are you getting to sleep on time? Are you making sure you're taking care of yourself? Are you watching the thoughts that you have? Are you watching the way you speak? Are you learning? Are you reading? Um, or are you just watching uh, some dumb episodes on TV that really don't mean anything? Discipline is the cornerstone of the first two. So remember, 